Statistics is going through a really fascinating period at the moment and, and Nesta, my organisation, is part of both uh, some UK and some Europe-wide projects on new kinds of economic statistics. And essentially they are trying to supplement the traditional surveys when a survey would be done of businesses asking them about their turnover, their staff, their exports, and increasingly uh, pulling together real-time data, often from the web, automatically. We've done a number of projects showing the value of this, particularly for emerging industries. So uh, last year we did a project on the immersive economy, virtual reality, showing where the companies were, what their turnover was, what their importance was. We've done this for jobs, looking at real-time data on uh, jobs demand and skills patterns. And done well, this shows an economy to itself in ways which are very different from perhaps the traditional ways of thinking. And uh, in, a, in a very live project we're now doing in several countries, we're doing this for innovation, using a combination of public data, commercial data and web scraping to show the emergence of new industries, new sectors, new clusters in real time. And our hope is this will make policy making much better at adapting to change than the traditional methods, which often got stuck in categories which made sense for the economy of the 1980s or the 1950s, but didn't fit the economy of today with all sorts of new industries emerging on the boundaries of software and creativity and immersion uh, or, or biology and computing uh, and so on. So the job of the statistician is changing. And I think if they do this new job well, they create much more intelligence for business to feed on. Exactly in the way 100 years ago, the advent of modern statistics meant that businesses could make decisions much better informed about macro conditions in the economy. Now with these new data tools, businesses can make better decisions informed in much finer detail about the micro as well as the macro conditions of an economy changing in real time. And this is a public good which should be provided or helped by government in order to make every aspect of the economy smarter so the individual business does not have to do this uh, for itself. And I think st statistics, as some people have said, is now becoming very sexy, which I don't think it was 20 years ago. Thank you.